Ever since I started this Exploring Haunted series back in 2016, in amongst the jokes and the laughter, there's always been the obsession to find out the truth. Are ghosts real? Can they interact with us? Or is it just a load of rubbish? Well, my friends, today we have a different type of haunted video. In this video, I am not going to stop until I find legitimate proof that spirits, ghosts, whatever you want to call them, are real. Even if it means going to a hundred haunted places, right here, right now, we are getting the answers. So let's do this. Oh, and shout out to Huawei, right, for letting me use their brand new Nova 5T phone, especially for this video. It's got the super night mode camera, a ridiculously long battery life that goes to 50% in 30 minutes, and four AI cameras on the back. So if you wanna check it out, the link is in the description. For now though, we begin on the 18th of October 2019 in a haunted forest with Cal Freezy and Annie Son Gibb. And my lord, it was a fail. It was rubbish. The rain poured, there were no spirits, and I'm angry. So after a little sit down and a chit chat, we decided day one was not our day. But this wasn't gonna phase me, right? Not even Jake Paul can stop me smiling. So on to day two, we're going to none other than Michelin Priory, right? The only place that I genuinely believe I've contacted spirits before. What about, so last time we were here, obviously yeah. there was, uh, the fire alarm went off. Yeah. Nothing, obviously, you know, there was no reason. Yeah. The fire brigade came and they were like, yeah, this has never happened. Yeah. Um, so the Tudor end. Yeah. Um, 1927. Yeah. There was a fire, which is where yeah. you see the man. Really? Yeah. And you get a man that makes a real guttural in the kitchen. Yeah, because in yeah. the kitchen last time, I uh, had a GoPro filming. Yeah, Joe was telling me, yeah. Yeah, and it got knocked off. Yeah. Got knocked off the side. Yeah, loads goes on in there. Really? Yeah. It literally sounds like there's 10, 20 people in that room moving stuff. Really? You go in there, nothing. There's nothing in there? No. Wow. So, and that's very active, that Tudor kitchen. Very active. So, there's loads. There's <laughs> loads, loads, right. Loads. Let's do it then. So, We're making yeah. our return. Michelin Priory. We are going to prove that ghosts exist tonight. Hopefully. <laughs> so, as we make our way into the building, there's only one place that I want to start in. The kitchen. And I've brought my mum <laughs> to join in with me in the hope that the family connection will encourage the spirits to communicate. I want to be friends. Friendly. Come into our... No, don't come into us. <laughs> That's not a good thing. <laughs> Mocking the whole thing. Hello spirits, I'm mum, Joe's mum. I'd love you to show me that you're with us. Spirit, are you able to make something move in the Tudor kitchen? If you could make a noise in the Tudor kitchen to let us know that you're here. Maybe knock something. Make a tap on the wall. Ooh, the spirits are not communicating. And after 45 minutes of trying this, we got nothing. So to boost our confidence, we took a quick selfie on the Nova 5T and a super night mode shot. We got stunning images, but no sign of spirits. And after continuing to experiment with different gadgets throughout the night, in the early hours of the morning, we finally had our first taste of a spirit. Calling out to the spirits in this room, please can you grab the pink ball? Show yourself by grabbing the pink bouncy ball. That's right, I'm offering my bouncy ball to a ghost. To think a week later I was presenting on Sky Sports box office. But continue watching. It's just on the windowsill. Look where I'm pointing. Oh, is that you? Oh, don't know if I feel. Okay, okay, that's lighting up a lot now. 
So the gadget going off is an electromagnetic field meter which should only go off if you hold it right next to a laptop, a phone or just something proper electrical. The only other thing that apparently sets this off is ghosts. And the way it's responding on demand, oh, this is weird. Did you die here? Can you make it flash up if you died here? Okay, oh, okay. Okay, that's flashing up a lot. Uh, did you, did you? Maybe, mate, maybe, maybe. Uh. As you can see, I'm pretty flustered, but this was not convincing enough and nothing else really happened. So we decided to attend a ghost hunt in London with the world's most haunted objects. The main objective of this was to learn how I could reach out to spirits in a safe but legit way. And I'm not gonna lie, right? I doubted that ghosts could really interact with these objects. But the weirdest thing that happened is I laid out this light up bouncy ball on the table next to the dolls and it just did go off. Oh my God, you're joking. No. No. No, but isn't that we just need like- to find out how it works. Yeah, we need to, it's not, wait, let me see if it's movement. Like if I, if I do that. It keeps flashing. Yeah. So you have to hit it in it order to light it up. Yeah. Literally, this is like a 10p piece of plastic that only goes off if you hit it. But this was not proof enough that ghosts exist. So, taking everything we've learned so far, on Halloween night, we have decided to book the most haunted room at one of England's most haunted inns, the 800-year-old Mermaid Inn. We're staying in room 16, the Elizabethan chamber, where there's been many reports of objects being thrown, people waking up to see a woman sat on the end of the bed, and two ghostly figures having a fight to the death. Boys, if you could like pitch a textbook haunted, this is like this is it, this is do you know what I mean? This is horrible. Like it's Halloween, we're in the most haunted room. Like if anything is ever gonna happen, it has to be tonight. What's in here? Oh, that sounds safe. Ooh, oh, imagine you just see like, oh, I don't know. Ghostbusters. Ah. Halloween. Gonna get some spirits. Me and the boys then see that the lights in the room just like start being a bit sketchy. So when we first came in, this one over here was flickering and now this one's just started going berserk. Oh, look at it. And yes, I'm about to start talking to the light. <laughs> if you can hear me, please can you make the light go out? Mate. Now it's made it go on, not out, but you know, that's weird. And we decided to then basically take it a step further. Yeah, that's good. That's, it's, oh, that's, boys, that's boys, ideal, boys, that's boys. ideal. Spirit, I know you can hear me. Please can you knock that pink ball off of the edge? Can you just push the pink ball off of the edge of the wardrobe? Weird, because I feel like it's something's gonna happen. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? You know, like normally, well, normally we don't feel like it's, but I feel it's like that's anticipation. Gonna, yeah, like something like that is gonna happen tonight. Wait, let me just say, Spirit, if you can hear me right now, can you make that light flash that I'm pointing to? Again, you're playing, you are playing with me, aren't you? You are literally, I know you like fun. You like fun, don't you? Look, he's making it absolutely flash. Do I sound like a mental person? Absolutely, but you can't deny that this is a little bit weird. I just is. I mean, it could just be very coincidental electrical faults. Like it, it could be, but it seems to be like responding to what I'm saying, so I don't know. That said, we still need some absolute concrete proof that spirits are actually real. Come on, Wella, you can do this. All right, so we're gonna set up Rodney just on the bed. 
right? Nicely in view of the GoPro, so... So if anything does go near this, like we, you know, it should do something. As well, the EMF meter is in sight, so if that goes off, you know, we're in the money. We're going to dinner. Spirits, I am inviting you to come and grab this teddy bear. I'm giving it to you as a gift, right? It's not a joke. If you'd like to just come and grab it, you know, in any time you'd like, that would be amazing. Feel free to do anything, you know, this is your home after all, okay? Thank you. So as you can tell, I'm trying to be as respectful as possible to the spirits in the hope that that's going to like encourage them to cooperate. What? Is it hit? Is it oh, I'm going the wrong bit. But imagine we hear something now. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Mate, I'm terrified. I am terrified. Boys, boys, I'm terrified. Boys, I'm terrified. Boys, 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 boys. Imagine we hear something now. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Mate, I'm terrified. I am terrified. Boys. Imagine we hear something now. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Mate, I'm terrified. I am terrified. Okay, now guys, I'm not gonna cut the footage too much from now. I'm gonna keep it very raw. I'm gonna talk again in a sec, because a lot of you may not know how the bear works, but it is, it basically, it's like you have to touch it, like you have to touch it in order to make it work. And it runs on a nine volt battery that I always make sure is working properly. But anyways, I'll go into more detail in a second. Just watch this first. Imagine we hear something. Oh my god! Oh my god! Mate, I'm terrified. I'm terrified. Boys. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Mate, I'm terrified. I'm terrified. Boys, boys, I'm terrified. Boys, I'm terrified. Boys, 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 boys. boys. I am. That is legit. That is it. That is it. That is it. What? Who's gonna go in? Who's gonna go in? Who's I'm gonna not. go in? I am terrified, mate. That is it. That was the thing. <laughs> that was actually, that was 10 that out of 10 going. There's no way it could be going. Wait, wait, so we are all here. Joe, yeah. Reese, Chris. Oh, can you open the door? I am too scared. Why did that go off when you said imagine if it goes off? Um, literally, literally. <laughs> oh my. Wait, just go in. Wait, is it? Just go in there, Luke. <sighs> right, wait. Come. So the GoPro was rolling. The GoPro was 100%. So we've rolling. caught that. We that mate. I. I actually cannot believe that that's actually happened. I actually oh. cannot believe that. <laughs> my heart is literally. Yeah, my heart is going. Oh, yeah, that is the point. I literally said, imagine if we hear something. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. I could not believe it. Like, okay, let's do it. Let's do it while we're in here. Okay, spirit. Please, can you come forward and grab the bear? Please, can you just reach out and grab it and hold it as hard as you can? Everything goes scaring me. Any noise? Wait. Okay. Spirit, in this room right now, please can you come forward and grab this teddy bear that I'm pointing to? Just walk up to it and grab it tightly. Alright, let's get to dinner. Okay, we're, yeah. okay, we're gonna go to dinner because, yeah, we need to go to dinner. But, you know, like I say, Spirit, feel free to grab the bear. Feel free to grab and move anything. You know, this is your home. <sighs> Alright, to dinner now. Not walking out the room last. Right. 
So if all left, we go again. Mate, remember, the GoPro would have got it last time. Like, yeah. I hope it got it well. I hope it lit up. Yeah, but you can imagine, like, the camera mysteriously goes out imagine, of focus. Imag oh, imagine. All audio cuts. Mate, ghosts are real. That is proof, surely. Mate, that is... Nothing can do that. Nothing can make that unless you physically... Unless you, unless you physically grab it. Physically. Should we try locking the door again? Okay. Yeah. Let's get some food. <laughs> Alright, we're off to get some supper. And the. Uh, imagine if the bear is going off right now. Alright, so we've got a hot cup of soup to begin. <laughs> it's great. It's like a bit garlicky, a bit oniony. All right, so we've got our nice supper. Okay, so just after 33 minutes after we've left the room, the bear has gone off again. This time it hasn't lit up, but when you only slightly touch it, the lights don't go off. So if anything does go near this, like, and look at the EMF meter as it goes off. And that's where it gets a bit mad because, because something has to be touching the EMF meter to make it go off and something has to be touching the bear to make it go off. So honestly, this, <laughs> this is mental. Like, it just is. Now, it's been like 45 minutes and let's have a look at the room. Now this is where it starts getting proper weird, right? Because look at the EMF meter. The way it's like pinging up like that, like literally to make it do that, you need to put your phone next to it while sending a text message or like put it next to a microwave while the microwave is on. There's no electricals nearby, and these are different clips from like the time frame of about an hour. But the way that keeps spiking, look, up to red, like to make it go up to red, do you know how much power that needs? Okay, so we're now making our way back to the room. That is room 17, which apparently a chair rocks by itself in. And here's our room. Oh. Boys, I'm actually a bit scared. I'm nervous. The GoPro is not filming anymore, but that might mean that it's run like out of battery or something. But let's have a look. Let's have a look. Wait, are you rolling? Yeah. Are you rolling? Yeah, yeah, rolling. Wait, look rolling. at the GoPro. Look at the GoPro screen, glitching out. That has never done that. That has never happened. Mate, what is that? 
Why is it doing that? That is, there's no reason. Wait, so it hasn't recorded like that? Mate, it better not have recorded like that the whole time. Imagine it's recorded like that the whole time. I think that backs up our case more than anything. What do you mean? The GoPro goes dodgy oh, yeah. no, when we capture so, something. No, that would be so annoying. Wait. Right, so this is our first time watching back the footage of the bear going off. Oh, oh got it. You've got that. Like, got it, and it, oh lit, up, it lit up as well. Oh, oh my. It went on for ages. Oh it went my on for God. ages. Mate, I actually could not believe it. Camera not is focusing. It, mate, focus. not focusing. Mate, ghosts are real. That is it. That is it. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. I could not believe that, bruv. I actually could not believe that. That is it. That is it, man. Okay, so to make this like go off, it has to be like a. You know what I mean? You have to proper like get that close. It doesn't just go off. Like it doesn't just go off. I have this in my house all the time, that's the thing. Like, it's just sat on the windowsill. Wait, is it on all the yeah, time? Yeah, man, because like, it's just got the battery on. The second the battery's plugged in... Not taking that home tonight, then. Oh, oh yeah, I'm not taking that home tonight. <laughs> I ain't taking that home. What am I going to do that's with it? Haunted. Yeah, what am I going to do with it? In the river. In the, ri <laughs> yeah. no, but it's in good, the river. We want to use it again. We want to use it again, because that's mad. Funny thing is, right, so I'm obviously editing this video... And I've just realised, I just do still have the bear. <laughs> I've taken the battery out, but like, imagine, like, imagine if it has brought something home. I'm going to be on night vision camera. Chris is going to be on the Huawei Nova 5T. So we're covered on pretty much all angles if something does happen. Smile. Way. Stunning. Beautiful. You actually look like such ghost hunters. <laughs> Just lights up everything, like every part of the room. Yeah, it actually does. Looks like there's professional light in it. Yeah, in it. It looks like That's it looks like the room is like like lit from all angles. If something does get, you know, in our way, hopefully you should get it on camera. That looks like where we are, uh, mate. Am, it does, wait, it is. Oh my god. Wait. wait what the, is? Wait. The background of the phone. Wait. Well, wait. Hold up. No. 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 Wait, wait. The background of the phone must no just must change to wherever you go. Like that, that, the phone must just do that. But that, not in a glass jar. No, no. <laughs> the phone isn't haunted. Or is it? That just was that exactly was where exactly. we were. Like the background had the mermaid in. There you go, boys and girls. Get the Huawei Nova 5T. Get nice and haunted. <laughs> All right, we're now completely turning off the lights. In three, two, one. Ooh. That's changed everything. <laughs> right. We're now completely sitting in darkness within this haunted Elizabethan chamber. Right. It's a great idea. <laughs> Happy Halloween, fellas. Spirits, I'm calling out to you. So if you could please give us a sign that you are here, that would be Amazing. Walk over to the bed and pick up the teddy bear that you see sitting on the end. Just walk up to the bear and touch it. Oof, back to real life, back to real life. All right, we're going to take a little break. Do you reckon the bear just... Surely it's not going to go off on its own. Well, well I don't know, was it... Nothing. Per well, no, but was it perched on something? Like, I just want to quickly test it. It left it there for ages. Yeah, it had been there for ages. And, but like, and didn't do anything. Pushing it, Bella. Like, yeah. you'd have seen them. Oh, yeah, because wait, basically, look, look, I just wanted to see if its bum <laughs> has any sensors in. Oh, so, that's me squeezing its bum <laughs> and uh, yeah it doesn't have any sensors in only uh, on the back and okay not not on the foot yeah nowhere in the leg is is there a sensor on the hand no 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 okay but look how much you have to grab yeah, you have that to squish it they're, they're really they're really heavily on the back like that's me barely there was nothing like, there. There was nothing behind it. And that's the thing, look, 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 I think I think when we watched it back on the GoPro just then, 
I think you saw this hand light up like this. Like, did, I think you did, which means it was touched from the back. And nothing. that only, look, look, uh, wait, I'll show on here. So on the bun doesn't work. Uh, uh, yeah, it has to be like, and nothing's touching that. Like, it's not like a bit of bedding was just like touching it. Do you know what I mean? Like, that was, that's being grabbed, mate. Like, it just has. Even so, it had been sitting there for ages yeah, anyway. Yeah, like, it was sitting there for so long. And, and yeah, just as we leave the room, that's mad. We then decided to leave the room again because it worked last time. It made, you know, the spirits come out, but we set up two cameras this time. We were gone about 25 minutes, but nothing happened. You know, the bear did nothing, the EMF did nothing. So we came back and tried something else. All right, so we turn into the spirit box. Sorry guys. So spirit, if you could try your best to say hello. Hello? That just said hello. That said hello. That said hello. Hello? That just said hello. That said hello. That said hello. Spirit, could you try and say your name? Uber. Do you want us to leave? the spirit seemed to be gone. So we decided to get some more shots on the Nova 5T and look at them. Stunning material. The quality is outrageous. Even this shot we took in extra low light came out looking unreal, but it did not reveal any spirits. That said, I believed we had already captured the best evidence we could get besides something like flying off the wall. The way the teddy bear went off, like honestly, that is the to me, that is the biggest proof I've had that a spirit has interacted with our earthly world. I don't want to sleep alone now. It's going to be so scary. It's going to be horrible. Well, you're, you're going to be like on the edge just waiting to hear that bear go off. <laughs> not going to lie, I literally did not sleep that night. But anyways, boys and girls, if you did enjoy, please leave a like right in. We put so much effort into this video. And do check out the Huawei Nova 5T in the description. Remember, it's got the super night mode camera, a ridiculously long battery life that goes to 50% in 30 minutes, and four AI cameras on the back. It's an unreal phone, and it's affordable. So enjoy that. Until next time, peace.